Welcome once again, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, to the realm of bizarre news. I'm Dr. Franklin Rule, and today we're going to start off with a trivia question. Let me extricate it here from its paper prison. The question, what is the term for a group of squirrels? Multiple choice, inverse alphabetical order. Is that a wedge, a leap, a dray, or a bale? Now, speaking of squirrels, it's just been discovered that California ground squirrels and rock squirrels actually like to nibble on the shed skin of rattlesnakes. They then lick their fur with the scent of the snakes so they can fool the snakes which have poor eyesight and rely on their olfactory scents. The snakes think the squirrels are other snakes and leave them alone. Brilliant idea. Very intelligent. Now for that trivia question. Once again, what is a group of squirrels called? Is that a wedge, leap, dray, or bale? And is that your final answer? A leap? No. It's a dray of squirrels, wedge of swans, leap of leopards, and bale of turtles. Yes. Now, here's a Christmas gift. A woman in Rock Springs, Wyoming, caught her husband opening a Christmas gift a week before Christmas, on Wednesday. Christmas is the next Tuesday. So you know what she did? She plunged a kitchen knife right into his chest. You know what I say? Justified absolutely justified. Remember, no wine before it's time, no Christmas gift before it's time. Yes. Now here's Madonna, the songstress. It's reported that she's now going on a porridge diet. Porridge, otherwise known as pottage, is simply meal or cereal that's mixed with water and, or in milk and boil until it's soft and mushy. You know what I say about that? Ugh. I'll stick with my chocolate chip diet. Works very well. Now it's time for the world of bizarre medicine. Let's see what's in the little black bag today. We have a note. The all-purpose monk's cow, tape, and a surgical scalpel. This pertains to a case down in Tanzania, in Africa. A brain surgery patient was wheeled in, but given a knee operation he didn't need. And the guy who had the, needed the knee operation got the brain operation. Now, the simple rule solution for that is as follows. We affix a point, the brain surgery patient with a monk's cow, so we'll know who needs the brain surgery. Now, there were three cases this year at the Rhode Island Hospital where patients were operated on the wrong side of their brains. Terrible mistake. One actually died. We just simply, to solve that problem, add a note such as right for the right hemisphere to this. Monk's cow. Now, you see someone walking down the street like this, you'll know, first of all, they need brain surgery, and secondly, they need it on the right side of their brain. Present company accepted, of course. Now, until next time, may the power of the cosmos be with you. Yes. Yes. Yes.